Hello everybody and welcome for a new video. Today's video will be on Terraria this time. It's not like the other videos, the other 10 first videos on Starbound, but it's on Terraria. It's a game that just goes off before Starbound and as you can see it's a universe that is a little bit different but it is the, in the same way of games and uh, it's a little bit like minecraft for, from the start you just have to cut wood and others but we are in this game in master mode so there are four different modes the easy the normal the the expert and the master and you have uh, an additional journey mode that is like a uh, creative but different and as you can see the little monster at the start just made uh, approximately half of my life of damage so it's a lot and we are actually looting some things finding stones and minerals to make just a bow and just some arrows and i'm breaking all the pots and minerals that i can found so it's a start of the game it's just normal I just sped up this because it's a little bit long and as you can see I have a thing that can make me higher it's a little thing that you just use on the beginning of the game later you won't use that but and the monster just deals me 40 damage this was a mineral tree it's a tree that grows up with gems and just go give you gems and tree seeds so I teleported myself back home to just make some furnaces, minerals, other gems and other. So I don't have a lot of, of just ingots, but I can make me an anvil. So I can just make the beginning of the first tools that aren't in the beginning materials. It's other than wood and it's a little bit nicer. So for now I just don't have any copper materials for a sword because I had a copper short sword, it's the beginning start of the game sword and I just put this in reverse because I found this like it will be nice and cool to put a sequence in reverse so as you can see I'm just repairing everything and I was telling just you the copper short sword at the beginning of the game you need to keep it because it will be useful to craft another weapon in the late game you can recraft another yes but you will not use your copper to just make this so I make a little house to begin my, my game because in this game you just have to be friendly with villagers a little bit like Starbound if you saw my latest videos uh, but this is a uh, different mechanics that make you trade with villagers if I can say trade and they have uh, biomes that they will prefer than other biomes and they want to live in that and the decoration isn't necessary uh, like in Starbound but it's nicer to have decorations so I just made a little house the frame isn't the one I want to have at the end as you can see in the next videos that will go off after this one the roof will not be the same but for now I just have this and I've stopped the time warp because now it's the night and in the night a lot of things happens in master mode so I want you to see like a real time gameplay in fact this is a two time gameplay because at this moment my game was lagging so I was at half of the real time and you have the real time and me I don't had it but uh, after uh, I will change the parameter that made my game a lot faster and yes I have just slowed down all my death so you can see the damage in two shots I was just killed by a demon eye so this is the demon eye in question 
and I will keep the cross and the just all symmetry things to make a symmetry because when you have a symmetry with more than five tombstones and another death so I just got my money back just before dying so not very useful and if you have more than five tombstones I think in the same place you can make a, a cemetery, a graveyard, and it will just make the monsters, the night monster spawns even at daytime. So it's, it's a good way to farm money on the beginning of the game. And uh, it's used to have some materials and objects that you just have only this way. So you will see that in the next video and another dead so another death excuse me so i have a lot of money one gold so i need to place my money in a container to protect it from monsters because money is a great current in this game and another game death so i will put a discount in montage in uh, just video editing because I, I just want to make it and it will be funny to see at the end of the video how many times I died because I just died a lot of times it's incredible because I'm not so good at this game but as you can hear in the name master mode is for masters so basically if I play master mode I know that I will take a lot of damage and just die a lot of time and others so but if i do that it's not just because i i'm mad and or just stupid or other it's because you have a lot better loots like two or three times more loots than without the master mode bigger persons to have great things and other so it's just the reason why, and yes, another die, another death, excuse me. So it starts to become um, a routine, and there's a lot of tombstones around my house, a lot of graveyards, I don't know how to call it, but, and I have a little invocation, uh, I have a little bird that just help me to deal the damage to monsters and this little bird I get it I got it in the big tree at the left of the world if you just slow down the inverted sequence and yeah it's a pretty nice thing to have in the beginning of the game and you have this in journey mode at the beginning of the game and you start with that like copper tools but this one I just got it and this is an invocation thing so it's a thing that you will have in your inventory with you or other and that will help you to kill monsters deal them damage and other and you don't have to do anything to control them you can control them with a special tool but you don't have to and um, you can with some achievements or tables or special things upgrade the number of them that you can have at the same time so here I'm just making the graveyard to put my tombstones so a little bit of terraforming not, not very interesting not very complicated but a little bit of it and I'm just better at the game no I say that and I take damage but when you play master mode, even if you don't really make a survival series on it, later you will be a lot better in normal mode because you just will not take as much damage as in this part of the game. So you will be, ah, oh, this monster isn't dealing me any damage, it's real nice. So when you are placing a lot of tombstones like this, there's a little bit effects of fog and other at the game for now it's not very big you can't see it have either than a little obscuration of my window my screen 
but after it will be a real fog on the ground so just pay attention and just a little bit of inventory cleaning my guide is coming back because he was killed at the night i'm not alone to be killed a lot of time <laughs> happily and uh, i will just make some exploration on the right side of the world so i think for the end of the video will be on exploration but no matters because it's the better part of the game and if you don't hear it, heard it, uh, the sound wasn't here, uh, it wasn't the game sound because I just forgot to cut the music and I can't sped up the game with the music, it's not accurate and not great. So I cut the music and sped up the normal sound and add again the music on it because in Terraria you need the music to know in which biome you are and to make some ambience so I just put the music back in and the sound or just here from a, a little bit of time and normally in the next videos you will have the sound so it, it's nicer to hear even it's, if it's two times the real sound and it doesn't sound great it, it sounds anyway so as you can see, is the Vautour, I don't know how to say it in English, just dealt me a lot of damage, but happily I have potions. So you can drink potions to heal yourself, but only one per minute. So you have to choose the better ones that you have to just win a lot of health points and don't have to drink a lot of them. And the weapon I'm using right now, it's a boomerang and I've just upgraded my wooden one with some falling stars that falls the night and I just upgraded it to Envo uh, Enchanted Boomerang, I think it's the English translation. So you can see the lot, the uh, many just biomes of the game because Terraria has a lot of biomes and, and each one has this own music so from the 1.4 upgrade and just I don't know to say it it was like um, like a thing to download I don't remember the name in English you have a lot of new biomes like in the desert now you have oasis oasis is uh, I don't know but it's a great thing to have um, Yes, I'm using rope that you can find in pots or with a special book that you place in your inventory slot. You can turn the, um, the liane, I don't know, again a word that I don't know. I will learn a lot of words in that. You can turn them into ropes because you need to make them. And just to breathe in the water, I'm using this technique, you can use it as well you just dig three blocks wide on the wall and three blocks high to let your your character pass and at the two last blocks you dig one block more higher so it makes a little air gap on the top and you can really nicely breathe on this air gap so a little bit of exploration because sometimes these things just goes to an enchanted sword I don't have the uh, one there but it, it could happen and just a little lit up a little bit of the cave and we are slowly coming to the hard part of the video so just make attention to to watch this because it will be nice and the slime just fall down in because he wanted to go with me but he cannot and uh, I will finish the video with uh, death I, I just spoil you because I, I thought he, it was really representing the master mode the death so I just put it from the beginning to the end so I, I want to explore all the terrorious world it's one of my objectives so it's why I'm just exploring the little caves at the place of just going randomly at the right and don't explore the caves. 
but for now I, I don't just explore everything I found and I just don't explore the I can tell you that in the next video you will not see the exploration of the left side because I just already made all a little bit of rushes because in the left side there is a the crimson biome and it's one of the most dangerous biomes of the game so the jungle I, I think the jungle is the second most dangerous biome and I just died so easily in this biome it's annoying and I think the first one is the corruption or crimson biome I'm already dying right now and the third one is the snowy biome or something like that and after it's it's the caves or I don't know but the caves are hard uh, almost but for me the harder is the crimson after it's the corruption you can't have the both in the same world and just after you have just the jungle because the jungle is already hyper difficult so i'm just getting to the end of the video so i will let you enjoying the video without me speaking with the music it will be nicer i think i don't i don't think it will be nicer because if it was i don't spoke in my videos but i will just let you enjoy the little music and Please subscribe, turn on the notification, and if you don't want to subscribe, just leave a like, it will help me a lot. And just tell your friend to watch this video, and see the next video every Monday. So, it was the dead, and goodbye, thank you.